okay guys in this video tutorial we will learn about a more needed circuit in the whole electronics and that is called as the edge bridge so what actually an edge bridge is edge bridge is actually a circuit that used to change its polarity on both sides of the load like a motor to drive it usually these type of bridges are used especially for motors like gear motors like stepper servos and all sort of motors so for it first of all we must go to the part section that is the component section and write here 2n the double two double two this is actually an npn transistor and it is to into to 92 package and the smallest one okay we have placed the four what's called as the two and double two double two transistor then we have to click on this transistor and we will just rotate it 180 degree okay now we got these also rotate like uh, clockwise and again clockwise so that its emitter must be in position with the other emitter so rotate clockwise and now we will rotate it 180 degrees oh, again it's having problem with so rotate 180 degrees okay mirror we must have to okay okay now now after doing this we got then rotate you should have to select by mirror okay now now you must have to join the collectors of the top two transistors and also co connect this collector with the meter of this transistor do the same for this transistor okay and now join the meter of these transistors so this is a loop for transistors now we will come towards resistors you must have to write 1k and press enter and then you will get 0.6 watt metal film and then you can select it okay, now one here one here one here and one here these are the current limiting resistors because base is very sensitive part of the transistor and giving a lot of voltage and current can damage it so okay like this okay now you are supposed to take battery battery and do this okay okay attach the top transistor part uh, so the collector part with the positive side of the battery oh, sorry and negative part with the a common emitter side of the transistors okay now we will connect these resistors diagonally that is by connecting the top left to this and lower left to the top right okay okay after this we will take one motor and write active active is actually used for the animated component that usually shows us the animation so one rotate clockwise yeah 
and we have to select it like this okay now you have approximately put all the components on the proteus window okay now we will take spdt that is single pole double throw active yeah this one this switch and we will okay we will just connect it with the positive side of the battery and battery must be of 9 volt because our motor is of 9 volt i think double click on motor it is 12 volt so make it 9 volt okay now we will attach now we have two terminals and we can attach one terminal with this part and one with this part now our circuit is completed we have to run it and press run now you can see that our motor is rotating okay now Okay, wait. Okay. First, see that it is going uh, anti clockwise and then clockwise. Anti clockwise and then clockwise. So, via this, you can change the polarity of the motor by a single switch. So, you can drive this simple motor via edge bridge in both direction so hopefully you got the concept i will attach the proteus file in the description you will find a link so thanks for watching